everyone, so for today's video, I'm going to be unboxing Eyes One's uh, second mini album, Heart Eyes, and I have the Violetta version. So this album comes with two versions, uh, the Sapphire version or the Violetta version. I was originally going to pick up both versions, but I kind of limited myself and just picked up one. And from other people's unboxing, I really like the look of the Violet Violetta version the most because they kind of kept the like flower themed in this album. So let's go ahead and get started with it. So here is the front of it. You have the back. And this is actually just a slip case for it because like a paper slip case because um, the album comes with a either you get a random group picture on the cover or one of the ran one of the members randomly. So let's see who I got. Ah, so I got Sakura. So here's just the paper sleeve for it. Nothing too fancy. It's just to cover up who you got, I guess. So I have that. So this is Sakura's cover. So pretty. I actually pulled her CD plate for one of the versions of the uh, uh, the first mini album. So. She's one of the Japanese members, so yeah. Okay, so you just take the slip case off. It's so pretty. I just really love um, the floral theme for Eyes One. So inside you get quite a few things. So I'm actually going to pull out my photo cards first and then I'll come back. Okay, I took my photo cards out, so let's go through everything that comes in here. So this is the photo book because it's so thick. Uh, let's go through this first. So this is the random member little like photo booklet, I believe. So I got Sakura. This was also random, but I just happened to get hers, her photo book for it, even though as well as her cover for this album. So. That's neat, it's kind of matchy-matchy. And she's really pretty. And you have a little thanks to from her. So yeah, you got that. Uh, next, uh, let's look at the CD plate. So here is a CD plate. It's on this cardboard. I just love this mint color for this album. It's so pretty. But yeah, the CD, the CD plate is also really pretty. So the Violetta version has more of a floral themed, and then the Sapphire version is more like a jewel, kind of Sapphire jewel themed. And let's look at this. Okay, so you get a standee. I'm not going to fold it out all the way, but here you go. This is what it looks like. So you got a group standee, that's very nice. And let's go through the photo book. Sadly, I have to say this might be my last Eyes 1 unboxing on this channel. Um, I don't know, you, don't, you guys probably don't know this, but I've been kind of decluttering my K-pop album collection. Because I feel like I own a little too much albums than I should be. So I've been um, kind of going through my collection and selling um, albums that I decided that I don't want to collect anymore. And sadly, Eyes One is one of the groups that I decided that I won't be collecting anymore. I only have, um, I previously bought both versions of their first mini album and I actually already sold one of the versions. I was going to um, at least have one copy of each of their albums, but I decided now that I'm not going to be collecting any other albums at all anymore. So nothing to do with if I nothing to do with that I don't like the group. I really really like them. I especially love um, all their title tracks that have they come out so far for the Korean side, anyways. But I just don't follow them as much as others as other groups that I do and I don't really have a particular bias in this group as well so I thought 
uh, I might as well kind of clear out some of my albums. So sadly, after this unboxing, I'm probably going to be selling this album. But yeah, it was fun while it lasted, I guess. I'm really sad about it because I really, really like um, their title track songs and their photo books that they come up with for their albums. They're always so pretty, so yeah. I actually had this album uh, quite a while, but I didn't even open it until recently, so yeah. Hopefully I can find someone uh, to sell this album to that would like it more than I do. Since I'm decluttering my K-pop album collection, I probably won't be buying as much as I used to. Like I buy, before I used to buy so many K-pop albums, but since I decided that I'm going to kind of limit myself, um, I probably won't be doing a lot of hauls on this channel as much anyways. I actually started to try out buying albums from eBay recently. So I actually bought uh, Red Velvet's newest summer album off of eBay. Okay, so you're getting into layers. Because um, the normal website that I usually go to for K-pop albums, it's only a good deal if I buy a lot of albums at one go. But I find that eBay prices are much more reasonable if you're just buying like one or two albums. So I'm trying that out. Hopefully um, it comes uh, to me safely. It's sh actually shipped out, so I'm just waiting for it. So that was a really nice photo book. Um, before I uh, show the photo cards, let me uh, put everything back together. Okay, so for photo cards, you get two photo cards in this album. The first photo card I got is of Unbi, I think that's her name, Unbi. Yeah, Unbi. So this is the back, really pretty. And then the other member that I pulled was Nako, I think. Yes, yes, yes. So this is one of the Japanese members, and this one is a signed back. So yeah, that was my photo card polls for this album. I hope you guys enjoyed this Eyes One second mini album uh, unboxing of Heart Eyes. Um, I'll talk to you guys in my next video then. Bye.